This is Josie, and we'll come back to another YouTube video. And me and Sarah have not started the game yet, so we're installing it now. And I already got it up. But you have to try and get on the one I want. I know. <laughs> I'm gonna go get us a house. Okay, I'm gonna customize I'm gonna customize myself as a kid. In disguise. As you. It's going to, I'm going to be the younger version of her. Just pretend. So what's your name going to be, Katie? Yeah, I'm going to buy my own house. Wait, what, 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 I'm going to be a kid. Yeah. And you're yeah. going to adopt me. No. Okay, then I guess we're not going to be trying to get on the same one. Okay. I'm going to adopt you. Okay, bye. Oh, I'm still going to cuss Allie, my I want to adopt you. You know I'm Allie, right? Oh, she's Susie. Oh, uh, something, nothing. I want to be a baby. Okay, cool. Good for you. So, yeah, I'm going to log in. Dog man. Whoa! I'm all done, Sarah. I want to be a kid. Shit, you. Guys, you did not hear me talking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, that's Sarah. My and her characters look literally the exact same. Okay, sorry about us having to pause about talking. It's just guys, we're doing, um, talking just privately. Okay, my game's are up. Yeah, 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 yeah. And plus, this time, I have a microphone. Oh, yeah, uh -huh. Okay, so this time I'm gonna. No, I just changed my skin of pink. Huh? <laughs> Rolls. Okay, so. I'm gonna be a kid. So, yeah. So, first I need to go customize myself. Oh, cool. Someone has a name as Sarah. Mm -hmm. My name's gonna be Josie. And my last name will be McDonald's. And guys, trust me, that ain't my real name. That's just my game name. What do we? Let's see. I'm a car I'm driving a baby. I want to be a kid. I'm a car driving kid. So I don't have color. But yeah. It's not change me into a kid. It's That's a glitch, Sarah. So guys, in the comments below... Tell me if you want this to be a series. And guys, yes, I am doing this on purpose. Don't oh, yay, I'm a kid. I'm driving underwater. <laughs> Literally. Okay, now. Now, guys, don't do that on Roblox. And especially if your parents tell you not to play it. Don't play it. Although my parents tell me not to, I play it anyway. Only for you guys, of course. Trust me, my mom don't watch my videos. Ah, what the fuck? Guys, mm. you know, I'm not seeing any messages. I'm doing all this thing stuff on purpose. Okay, back up. I need to back up. Go forward, back up. Do something silly. You can hear silly in the background. It's probably because I'm a, fucking, a dang car driving baby. Yeah. Okay. 
guys, I'm supposed to be a guest, but I really don't Can care. Can you be my mommy? Can you be my mommy? That's what I'm going to say, guys. Hey, you know what, guys? I'm just going to walk. Was that car just driving itself? Sorry, the car just drove itself. Guys, show me in the comments below if that happens to you guys sometimes. Whenever you all play it. Oh, uh, my mommy said no. I mean, you're random person that you literally just met? Yep. That's not so Adopt hmm. me. Adopt me. Jesse, I'm trying to say I'm it. talking to someone who... Adopt me. Adopt me, please. Adopt me. I'm not just messing with Adopt up. me. Adopt me, adopt me, please, adopt me. What oh, are these my skin colors? Uh oh, spaghetti, oh, I can't talk. No, I don't want you. Don't Can want you be my mommy? I don't want you, you, you. So, yeah, guys, this is technically me for now. I'm butt naked. So, morph magic, morph magic, morph magic. So yeah, everything about my face shall be a random pink. And, woohoo! Yay, you got a mommy! You got a mommy! So yeah, guys, this is my brand new face, I guess. Katie. Oh, this one. I wonder who's downstairs. I feel like my Guys, if you want us to do a Draw My Life, I've been wanting to ask this forever. If you want us to do a Draw My Life, please say it in the comments. I always forget to ask. But finally, today I have remembered. I have an awesome memory sometimes. I said sometimes, not all the time, guys. If you guys want us to do a special video for 20 subs, then notify us in the comments. Because guess what, guys? We have we actually have 20, even though it's... I got so many sissies. How many? One, two, three. She has three sissies. You're quadruplets. Okay, now I'm going to put J-O as lightning space M-C-N-O-R-I-L-L -L. Swash Line Swash Broke My mommy's name Girly Sarah Fuente Curly Sarah one two three. Oh, I was just climbing like the rail. Oh, that's cool. Cause I was like, literally, literally just doing crawling. the same. Oh, that's awesome. I was literally just doing the exact same thing. Guys, nice. what are you, a baby or a kid? You're a kid. What are you? I'm a kid. Kid. Yeah. I wish I could be a crawling. I'm gonna go pick my bed. <laughs> Dee, dee, dee. I'm going to be adopted. I call it the blue bed with the panda. <laughs> of course, because you love pandas. Okay, guys, now it's time for the hard part. Oh, Sarah! Sarah! Cry. Sarah came to adopt me. Hi. Adopted me immediately. Oh, Mama, die! I'm gonna go to spawn and watch for her. Mama, I'm tired. Sarah, I'm sad. Wait. Daddy. Mm. Mm. My mom 
now he's giving me a hug. Mm, let me in, mommy. Thank you, mommy. Push me. Yay! Where do you live? No, I'm not going to type that because I think I know where she's going. Oh, well, shoot. My mommy's so pretty. Shoot, I think my mom lives in one of these small little houses. <laughs> my mommy lives in the big home. Ew. She doesn't live in one of those tiny little houses. Nope. See? You're lucky. Your mom Probably because so I can have so many kids. I mean, she has so many kids. Look, I'm flying. Ooh, Mummy lives at the camp, I think. Oh, shit. I mean, shoot, shoot, shoot. Yay, I'm back in the store. Okay, I accept everyone's friend request, guys. So, yeah, guys, if you, like, watch me every day and stuff, then, um, just Where send me a friend go? request, okay, and uh, I can talk with you. Oh, yay, she came to customize. Sissy, oh. don't tell me what to do. <laughs> what the fuck? She's counting. <laughs> one, two. She actually said one, two. Get away. And then hashtag, hashtag, hashtag. <laughs> so there he is. Well, my mommy is so nice. She's letting me get whatever I want. Oh, they lock the doors. Well, maybe Mama she's older than you. talking to. I'm gonna see if my mummy likes some. Um, likes my like my new hairstyle. <laughs> okay. Um. And then tomorrow my birthday will be. Oh, cool. Mommy own a car, I think. I don't want a kid to be my daddy. Oh, shit. I need to go to spawn for my mummy. Okay, he's not a kid anymore. He's going to be my daddy. In the entire nation. Be as big as me. Be no, Pop. big as me. Mommy, unlock doors. Wait, are you seriously saying all this stuff? No. Everything is awesome. Someone just said awesome. Wake up! Mommy! Ha <laughs> oh, shoot. Okay, Mama. I'm coming. Strawa! Me dear Strawa! 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 Eh! I can't. Eh. So slow. My other sissy. <laughs> That's a lady. I'm talking to my sissies. That's hilarious. I don't have a sister. Yourself. We are not getting in that bed. And I got a brother. Ah, someone, someone killing me. No, they're not. Where's mommy? Now I know how my kids feel when they're when I'm um a grown up and I lock them in the house. Lock them the house. I guess I could just go to the bathroom. Oh, sure. Mommy, are you okay? Yeah, you're okay, Mama. Hey, 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 hey. Does your mom live in the red houses? I'm about to find out. Yay! What? Yay! I'm in the 
just grow it. Ooh, is she taking me to McDonald's? No, poo poo. <laughs> poo poo in the party. Poo poo in the party. <laughs> I'm trying to turn around so I can actually go. Oh, where does me mummy is? There we go. Now sit. Look. <laughs> She's literally on the door, <laughs> guys. Wait, I forgot to wash my hair. Oh, yeah, she does live in a red house. My little mommy lives in the biggest house. <laughs> I'm going to turn on the stove. <laughs> Are you going to go inside of it? Wait, I'm on the stove. <laughs> Never cook your baby. Because <laughs> they die immediately. Literally. Where are my sissies? I found that out the hard way. Uh oh, my mom's talking to a boy. Uh oh, spaghetti. -o. Ashley peeing the cute two, three, this. four. Allie <laughs> needs a boyfriend. Where's my mommy? Oh, yay, my mommy lives in a big house. Where's my mommy? She's not coming back. My I don't mom even know where my sissies are at. My mommy don't live in a red house. Where does she live? I'm guessing in a big house. I can't find my sissies. Mommy, you live here? No, not there. Wait, maybe there. Sissies. Nope, next house I'm guessing. Dang it. Can I go out? No. Uh, Mama, are you okay? Yay, she's fine. Mommy. Mommy. Mommy, I need you. Mommy, I need you. I gotta go Are we going home? Aww. Okay, goody. He's going to a boy. Did I seriously just reset myself? No. Most magic. Actually, no. You know what, guys? I'm gonna be a girl that wants to adopt kids. So, yeah, guys, I'm gonna go customize my character, and I'll be back. Me too. And yeah, guys, so I'm not going to be doing any more of that. Just going to be showing you guys on YouTube. So if you like Dan TDM, please like this video. And you guys, don't look at that. That's what my people watch. I want to turn this up. Hello there, today's video is for all you lazy people and I'm not just blaming you, I'm not pointing fingers on you only, I'm lazy. I was really lazy to make this video actually. You're probably watching this video when you should be doing something else and if you are, give this video a thumbs up just so that I get to see how many people really, you know, are lazy. Lazy people unite! I really like my last video, my beauty hacks every girl should know. It's not just for girls, it's for guys too, okay? So if you haven't watched that video, make sure you check it out after you're done watching this video. It will be down in the description box or in a little annotation up top. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe and join the Audi's family. Let's see how our lives can be a lot easier. Mm -hmm. and more. Yeah, we're just a little lazy. It's okay. I understand. 
If you're feeling a bit lazy to do your hair, now all you gotta do is put your hair up into a ponytail. Now you can curl it or you can straighten it using this technique. Whatever you do, it's gonna shorten your time by half the time. So I tend to do this a lot. It's also helped my hair grow a little bit healthier. And by the time you take it down, whether you curled it or straightened it, it's gonna cut your time by half. So you know, you can go ahead and be lazy and use that time to do something else. If your hair smells a bit funky, but you know, washing your hair is just such a hassle, man. So what I do is I just take my brush, my favorite perfume, spritz it on there a little bit, and then you just kind of comb it through, and this was going to stick on your hair. It's going to make it smell so good. We've all been in those situations where we have to call a company that answers in a million years, so I totally understand what it's like. You're just there waiting, and they're like, okay, now it's time to press one, and they put that really obnoxious music. Well, I got you covered for all you lazy people who don't like to wait on the phone. But there's a really magical app called the Fast Customer App who will never, ever, ever make you wait on hold again. So what it does is it calls the multiple companies that are actually on, they have like a million, literally. It waits on hold, and then it actually calls you when an actual human being is on the line. How great is that? Something that I really hate is typing in my email address over and over and over again. So here I'm showing you a way to actually program your phone so that you can have a little shortcut. So every time I type an email it just types in my email so no more waiting I don't know if you're like me but I'm always lazy to make my bed but I found a technique that works so what I do is I just put all my pillows and I just kind of put it to one side and I sleep on the other side now this won't work if you have a significant other but hey you know and then you just put everything back to where it is and it just makes it so much easier to make my bed I actually feel a little bit happy when I do it I don't know about you, but I feel like sticky notes are kind of not making it to the millennium. I always forget everything. I end up putting much more than I need on my computer. So what I'm doing now is actually texting myself reminders of what I need to be doing. And it works awesome because it actually texts you back like double. So now you're like, oh, I got to go to the gym at 8 and I got to do this at this time. So it's just a great way to remind yourself of things you got to do. I love reading, but I hate reading the things that I'm assigned. It just makes me so lazy, so sleepy, and so entirely bored. So what I'm doing now is I'm making myself a little incentive that every time I read a paragraph or I read a page, I give myself a treat, a little candy. It works so much better. I promise you it's going to help you read a lot better. It's going to help you retain information a lot better because you're just kind of rewarding yourself. It also helps me read a lot faster, which I can't complain. If you're like me and you spend half your day or your week or your month watching Scandal, I'm obsessed with this show. I'm always eating my little, you know, chips, and I can't say that this doesn't happen. Yes, it does. And I don't want to clean it up. I just don't want to. So I just take some post-it notes, and this works so awesome. All I do is I just kind of put them over, and it picks everything up for me as I'm still watching my show because, I, you know, I'm lazy, and I don't want to be unentertained. And there you go. If you're just jamming to your favorite song over and over again, something that you can do to not have to be pressing it over and over again because we're lazy here is you put the song, and then when you go to the YouTube on top, all you got to type is repeat. And this is going to take you to a website that basically just allows you to listen to the song over and over again so you can just keep jamming. If you're not in the mood to make yourself a quick snack, I got a recipe for you that's going to make it so easy. All you're going to do is take some yogurt, put it in a little plastic baggie, and then you're just going to make these little, I don't know what these are called, like yogurt pops. And then you put it in the freezer for about an hour, and these are absolutely addictive, absolutely delicious. I am one of those people I'd rather wear wrinkled clothes than have to iron it. So what you can do is you can take a shower and hopefully you do take a shower and you're not too tired to take a shower or lazy and then the steam will actually help your shirt de-wrinkle a little bit. It works great. If you're not in the mood to clean your room but it's smelling a little bit, you can use some tea bags and what I do is I just put a little bit of these tea bags into my drawers or into, I don't know, something that I just want to smell better and it just gives a really nice aromatic smell. That's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumb. Hello there ladies and gentlemen. Today's video is going to be on hacks that every girl should know. Let's be honest, being a girl can be quite tricky. We deal with a lot of stuff and my boyfriend doesn't agree. He's like, no, you guys get it easy. You guys let me know down below. Give this video a thumbs up if you think that it's kind of hard to be a girl. It really is. It's just, this is 
Yes, so guys. Hard. I don't know. This video will teach you a whole bunch of things that you've never before. Yeah, guys, you guys out there, it really is hard for us to be um as as a girl. Yeah. Okay. If I don't look good about calling, where's the, where's the, where's the, where's the, then ugly. Seriously? We're seeing on just ways to make your life easier. I mean, we're already girls. Girls. We run the world. Girls. We run the world. Girls. It's also a collaboration with my lovely friend here on YouTube, Beauty with Tashi. She's amazing. She has just really beautiful, she's just really pretty, but I mean, other than that, she's really great with makeup and just hair tips, so make sure you guys check out her video. She's also going to be doing a beauty hacks video, so, you know, just in case you need any more hacks, her video link will be linked down below. Make sure you check her out and show her some love, tell you that the Audi's family sent you. That's her name, by the way, people. You okay with that? I think it's kind of weird, but it's okay, because we we're all kind of weird here, so. Anyways, without yeah. further ado, let's just get on to the video. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Hold on. If you struggle with short nails and a strategy to really make them grow, all you're going to need are press-on nails. Now, this is really great because it helps your nails look pretty throughout the week as your real nails grow in. This doesn't require the glue that messes up your nails. Instead, it just requires these little tackies that you apply underneath the nail. This lasts about one week, so in the meantime, your natural nails are growing and they're looking pretty at the same time. This has been a really great strategy of mine because I tend to get a little bit stressed and I have a really bad habit when I'm school to bite my nails but this has really helped me just grow out my nails and you know give my nails that chance of life if you don't feel comfortable with having hair on your arms and your mm -hmm. only choice is to shave it think again girlfriend or boyfriend don't be shaving those arms don't shave it just instead use a cream bleach I tend to use this a lot and it just minimizes the appearance of your hairs it makes them look a lot more natural and it's less defeating on your skin this hat goes out to all you ladies who are afraid of your hairstylist I totally understand it's very terrifying so if you feel like your hairstylist is one of those that never listens to you always cuts excessive amount of hair then I have a solution for you all you're gonna do is when your hair is the way you like it take a picture of it Put it in your memory, leave it in your phone. Next time you come around, you show them those pictures and they know exactly what to do. Ta-da! No more bad hair days. I'm a huge fan of red lips, but I do find them a little bit hard to wear. They tend to smear and it's just kind of hard to have glossy lips when they're so pigmented. So, what you're going to need for this to make them matte is some powder. And all you're going to do with this powder is just take a little bit out and then just buff that basically onto your lips with a tool like one of these and it just kind of helps minimize the gloss effect it's really interesting how how i guess this comes about i don't know if this is like makeup science but it tends to work on me all the time it helps mattify the lipstick or the lip gloss and it just makes it so much more wearable and i really like it this next hack is taking a note card and cutting it to the shape of your eye. If you're someone that really just creates a masterpiece, a Picasso masterpiece on your eye, and then your mascara ruins it, this is going to help you guys out a lot, especially if you're in a hurry. I also find that this method is amazing for really coating all the lashes in the Sorry about that. And then, no further than the kitchen. Baking soda is amazing for this. It naturally has this effect to make your teeth whiter. I use this about Tried once it. a week, and I definitely it's notice awesome. results. Try it out. If your skin tends to be very sensitive to fake jewelry, then I have a solution for you. All you got to use is a little bit of Vaseline. This is just going to help mm -hmm. the mask mm -hmm. from the skin. Oh, guys. Have fun. <laughs>
was so much fun filming it. Also, quick disclaimer, everything was obviously over-exaggerated for video purposes, so please don't get offended if, like, you don't do that, because I know children now are a lot different than they were when I was this. You might be different, basically. Yeah, I hope you enjoy this video. If you want to see the bloopers for this, it's going to be on my vlog channel, so I'll leave that down below, and I'm also daily vlogging, so you should check that out. Also, check out my social medias and Becca and Phoebe social medias. They have Instagram, and that's kind of... Yeah. Yeah. This video is also a collab with one of my best friends, Tatiana Boyd, so make sure to check out her video after this one. If you enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe oh, and guys, if you ever want to do a collab quick, with me, it's easy and yes. Guys, if you ever want to do a collab with me, it's where two people do it, do it and views from each channel launch. If you haven't watched Bazaba, you don't they need you probably don't know what it is. Um, but still, can you, um, please message me in the comments about it? Okay, now let's continue. Let's get on with the video! I had the worst day ever. So annoyed at Lucy. It's dive time. I hate Lucy because she wouldn't let me borrow her purple rubber. She gave me her pink one instead, and we all know that's her second favourite. Does that mean I'm not her favourite anymore? And also, in the playground, she would not let me join in with her. Elizabeth was being so horrible to me earlier today. I'm literally, I need a rant. I just need a rant to Becca, like right now. <sighs> Which one should I play? The Tandox. If I should buy the husky or the Dalmatian. The husky. Okay. You've got the new high school musical game. I know, I got it for Christmas. I'm so excited to go on my school trip. I've got my disposal camera ready. Everyone's going to be so jealous because mine's pink. Yes! Do you want to play spies? Yeah. Okay, you go over there. I'll go here. Mission abort. I'm hiding under a green blanket. Over. Go under the desk. Over.
by the way, so you're never going to get anywhere with mine. Oh my gosh, did you 
you see this new picture of Jefferson? No, what no, let's see. Oh. Oh. Who's going to oh. ask this Snapchat? I think Not me. I think you should. You should. You, you were so you were playing with psychology. Oh my god. You he was, was literally. Yeah. At it. If I ask. from the title this is a child versus teen summer edition it's summer holidays right now but i'm wondering is it summer holidays for you or you go back to school comment down below what you're doing right now because i'm interested i'm gonna start a child versus teen like series for different seasons and situations i guess also you're probably thinking what is up this gross background i'm currently on holiday which brings me to say you should check out my vlog channel because i've been daily vlogging and the vlogs are pretty hilarious now i'll link that down below and my social media also, this video is in collaboration with two of my best friends, Abby and Livy. So you should check out their videos down below. You should definitely check them out after this video. And yeah, I hope you enjoy this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any more videos like this. And you should join the family. Let's get on with the video. Make sure to put your armbands on. Lower, lower, that's good, yeah. Oh, I've taken my 
like 500 already. Can you take some on my phone? No, that's horrible. Please take another one. No. video if you want us to do a draw my life please notify me so yeah that's all we have for this video goodbye sorry about that goodbye